Hi, hi, guys. How are you doing? This is Don Santo, the one and only Nissan Central Africa, the whole world even in Google. Yes, we are here and we are ready to begin. Let's wait for a few of our friends to join in. So it has been a very long weekend, a very long holiday, and uh, I believe this was the best time for us to relax our minds, and also it gave us an opportunity for those of us who are usually busy with also other things to be creative and come up with various contents. Yes, that is what we are doing now. and. Uh, we thought at the end of, the, of this all, what if we joined together and discussed about a very important topic. This topic is about music business. This will be a new series. We'll be discussing about different topics in the music business. And remember, music business is M-U-S-I-K, business, B-U-S-I-N-E-S-S. So today we are discussing about social media and how you can use social media to promote your music. So I've got some tips that you can actually go through and learn. But uh, most importantly, remember that social media uh, or generally the digital space plays a major role in selling brands selling products, in uh, entertaining people, in connecting people. It's a platform where you can use it to get or be what you want. So if you are wise, if you are timely, and if you apply smart goals, you'll be able to achieve anything you want through social media. So I've got some nine tips on how to promote your music on social media and one important one is create a solid strategy now what is a strategy a strategy is that plan that you come up with to direct you in on how you're going to sell your product sell your brand now marketing yourself doesn't have to be a very difficult task and you know that also you can be able to maximize your potential if you can be able to plan ahead and come up with a, compre a comprehensive marketing plan. Now, once you have a marketing strategy intact, then you can now start applying each and every element of the marketing strategy to ensure that you achieve the best results as you intended. Now, Another thing is keeping your brand consistent. That is number two. You must keep your brand consistent. What do I mean by making your brand or keeping your brand consistent? I mean, whatever image you portray on your social media platform should be the same across all the platforms. That is, if you're on social media platform like Facebook, the same profile that you're using on Facebook should be the same profile you're using on Twitter, should be the same profile you're using on Instagram, should be the same one you're using on TikTok and using on other social media platforms that you are live. Now, another thing is, I've mentioned a number of social media channels. Someone might ask me or say that, uh, but you know, I'm only on Facebook and Instagram, but I'm not on Twitter. I'm on uh, Telegram, but I'm not on, you know. One thing I can say is, number three tip is find which social media works well for you. Now, not all social media platforms are created for, are equated equally. They are created with different intentions. They are created with different objectives. Now, you, you looking at what you have should be able to direct you on which social media would work well for you. You know, 
some of us use Instagram all the time, right? Now, and uh, myself, I can't seem to figure out TikTok, you know. As much as I get reports of millions of streams of my music on TikTok, but personally, it has become very difficult to get what TikTok is all about. I don't know, I, ca I cannot do the ding, 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 you know. Eh? TikTok is all about fun, TikTok is about being playful. I am, but I can't keep up, you know. Yeah, so find that social media which works for you and make use of it positively and wisely. Okay. Another important thing we should remember is we have tools, online tools or digital tools, which you can use to monitor all your social media activities. Some are used to schedule even your posts. And these tools sometimes also come with tips which you can learn or you can use to learn you know, on how to manage each and every individual social media differently. So we've said that number one you have to create a very solid strategy number two you have to keep your brand consistent and number three find which social media platforms work for you okay the fourth one is that you must be consistent with how often you post what do i mean by this uh if your timings are usually in the morning hours in the afternoon and in the evening remain consistent with her, with how you post unless now when you have those necessary posts that you want to give so uh, there are those who post uh, like 10 times a day you know when when you post 10 times a day it annoys the hell out of me I might easily and and very 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 uh, which word can i use you know such can make me mute such a particular artist or they can make me even unfollow them all together depending on also what they are posting so you know post it is on wakni you know so what do we do Yeah, so you must be consistent on how often you post. So here are some tips on how you can post. If you're on Twitter, you can post one to four times a day. If you're on Twitter, post once or up to four times a day. Uh, when you're on Facebook, you can post between four to seven times a week. On Facebook, post four to seven times a week. And then on Instagram, post one or two times a week so if you maintain these ideas and come up with the best content you can be able to post i think that will come in handy so number five is connect with fans the most important way of doing things is making sure that everything you do is geared towards you connecting with the fan how do you in connect to the fan the only way you can connect with human beings is through interaction. Now, interaction is a very important aspect here. When you are creating the social media content, try to make them to be as interactive as they can be. Why? A great method, you know, for doing this is to let your audience in on the interactive process. You know, now for example, you can do a campaign and in this particular campaign you can get your fans to submit something for example an artwork via instagram for example and tag you for a chance to win something you know or for the chance to have their art on the next album cover okay? you can also post a snippet of a song you're doing or uh, you're working on to let everyone know and decide on the name of that particular song so these things could be as interactive as possible things like 
this may make the fans also feel part and parcel of the brand and will be able to grow with you and be part and parcel of your music. That is very important. So, number six, spread out your content. Now, I'm imagining that, for example, for example, you have an album or you have a song. Now, that if you have an album or a, or a song that is coming out, split that event into uh, maybe a bunch of posts. And these posts will be hyping up or uh, making people have that anxiety to get to listen or watch that music that is coming out you know it's like uh, you're creating demand be able to hype it out and then spread your content on on social media and make sure that between now and then i'll be posting a b c d i like working on on a calendar or a schedule that i actually put and make sure that my content is well organized including the communications including what the theme and everything the messaging like i have to work on my content early enough and then start posting it sometimes there are those random things i do like for example uh, going live and talking to people today you've seen what classic has done classic has also just come out today and said yo guys you know what today don santo will be here to speak about how to promote your music on social media you know uh, which is fine but the other content are well scheduled are well organized and then they are also supposed to um, have an objective uh, you, you just don't have a post of uh, your good looking self and you put a caption yes it works uh, it works but I've seen many people complain about artists only posting themselves like they have insufficient content I don't think it should be part and parcel of people who are blamed for having insufficient content you try as much as possible to make sure that you have enough content and spread it out so number seven schedule your posts in advance like i said i do schedule my posts in advance why so that i can have enough time to do other things you know uh everyone is busy you're busy being a musician and doing musician things so how can you find the time to keep up with all these things and still post? You can schedule. Social media like Facebook, social media like uh, Twitter, you can be able to schedule your posts. Also on LinkedIn, you can, you can be able to schedule your posts. Schedule your posts and create them way in advance so that you don't have to stick doing everything every day. You have other things to be doing so that you can be able to grow as a brand. So number eight, be authentic. You know, the best thing about social media is being able to connect with your fans in real time. You know, to really connect with them, there are very many things you do. So you need to be most of, the, uh, most of all very authentic self. Then your audience can tell if you're not being real with them. You know, they'll know. And they'll stop engaging with you. So the best thing you can ever do is try to be real with your audience by being authentic uh, we copy a lot human beings copy a lot one thing I've uh, made sure that I don't do is copy I do my research I do listen to people who have done it who have made it in life and I also listen to even children speaking because through these voices a lot of ideas come up through these voices you can hear wisdom and through these voices, even Jah speaks to us through them. So I tend to listen a lot. I listen. Sazine kama nza umbuakni pia na a few seconds. Beyond which, uh, naturally, ita kuangumu. So you can sync up all your posts across all platforms. 
So try to come up with ways on how you can be able to sync up. Since now you're talking about the same message across all social media platforms, you can be able to plan well enough and say, these are the creatives I'm going to work on this, these are the posts I'm going to put, or these are the, you know. It should be very simple to do, but sometimes it can take uh, a lot on yourself if you decide to be doing these things every day. So generally, you be authentic and then sync up all your posts across social media. I think those are the tips for today. Mm, maybe if you have any questions, you can put them on the comment section. We'll be able to answer them as we go by. Um, basically, you know what I do. Uh, the introduction today on the social media has been, uh, <laughs> what can I say? Yeah. It has been very, very, very interesting. I didn't know I had such a very long introduction. Yeah. But I hear that if you if you go through my biography, you'll be able to see a lot. And all this is just bullshit. What's important is I love music and music is my business. So if you love music, let's do something together. Let me just play something here. So you've heard about this song, my new song, Famous. Famous is a song that I did, I wrote a while back, almost three years back, but decided it was time to release it. Since I appreciate all your comments all the time, let's go. If I had your number, in my phone book or hit me on my Facebook, you'd be famous. Oy, 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 oy. Soon I've been a meeting in my bed in the morning. You'll be pregnant. You will be famous. Oi, 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 oi. No, 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 Vicente, no, 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 with our favorite stereo called pop listening on the air, 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 air. Oh, ja, oh, ja, thank you because of you. Do, do. If I had your number, in my phone book or hit me on my Facebook, you'd be famous. Oy, 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 oy. Famous, 
Famous is a song that you can check it out and be able to give your comments. Also leave your comments in the comment section. And as usual, this is the one and only in Central Africa, the whole world, even Google. Bless the classical.